Hi guys, how you doing? I owe you an apology. Uh, a little while ago, I put out a video saying, settled into the new job, things are going okay, and I'm going to start making some, some more videos again. And that didn't happen. Uh, so I thought I'd start off by giving you the reasons that it didn't happen. Uh, broke my leg, basically. Um, that's the short version. The long version's a little bit more entertaining. Uh, if you're squeamish at all, I'd probably just skip this video and, uh, and wait for the next one to come out. Hopefully, it won't be the best part of a year. So, uh, what happened? I was at Noble Science. I was practicing some Scottish backhold wrestling. Uh, I've done some videos about Scottish backhold. It was a class run by Scott Mellier, who's a good friend of mine from uh, way up north, uh, up in the, the wastelands of Scotland. A fantastic wrestler, really skilled martial artist, great instructor. If you ever get to see any of his stuff or get along to any of his classes, do. Um, you won't regret it. Um, and I was training with, with a friend of mine, somebody I've trained with quite a lot of times. We have a tendency to get a little bit competitive. And uh, rather than just simply doing the drill, we started experimenting a little bit and playing with it and seeing seeing what we could get from the position we were in. Uh, in all honesty, probably shouldn't have done. Um, but, you know, that's, that's kind of how you learn. Once you've got the technique in the drill, you kind of start playing a little bit with it and seeing what else you can do from that technique. And that's what, what happened. Um, I went to throw him, I went to sweep him with my right leg, and he went to grapevine my left leg to, to stabilise himself so that he we wouldn't fall. However, I hit him pretty hard with my leg as I went to sweep, and he did fall, but he was very, very clearly and quite strongly attached to me at that point. We both had our grip around each other, and he grapevined my leg with his leg. I swept his other leg away, he started to fall, but as I did that, my right leg bent sideways, and we both landed on top of it. I hit the ground. I think I might have technically won the wrestling bout. Not much of a consolation. And, and Dave, the guy who I was training with, might disagree, but I'm going to claim it because he walked away and I didn't. I dislocated my patella and I, it, was, it was quite sore, smarted a little. So I got another good friend of mine who was there to help me relocate it, got them to pull on my foot while I guided my patella back into place. It clunked back in. A lot of the pain went away at that point. So I put a couple of knee supports on, strapped it all on, carried on with the rest of the day. Now obviously I didn't train because it was really quite sore. Um, I assumed it was a soft tissue injury. So later that night, after the Noble Science had finished, I went to Amy. I went to, to the, the emergency room for those of our American brethren who are, are watching. And they x-rayed it and said, no, no, it's just a soft tissue injury, just a ligament, a sprain. It'll, it'll be okay, uh, rest up and we'll send you for some physio. Some weeks later, I still really couldn't walk. Um, I could just about get by with one crutch, but it was, well, not to put too fine a point on it, it was bloody painful. Uh, the physio referral had never turned up, and I realized that one of the many things that my lovely new job gave me was private health insurance. So I went to see a specialist sporting knee injury surgeon. Um, and he took one look at it and went, yeah, that's not right. Um, he sent me for an MRI scan, MRI'd it, and the MRI showed quite clearly that there was a large piece of bone that should have been the end of my femur, um, forming the top half of the knee joint, was floating around at the side of my knee. So he, he took me in and opened my knee up and screwed that bit of bone back in place. And I've spent the last five and a half, six months uh, learning to walk again. Today, for the first time, I actually realised, I was stood in the kitchen, I think I might be making the kids breakfast or something like that, and I realised that my knee didn't hurt. And that's the first time in seven months. So to celebrate that, I thought I'd make a video and say hi. Um, it's lovely to be back. And I hope you're pleased to see me. Let me know in the comments below 
what you want the next video to be. They've got there's some stories of greatness that I'd like to get back to, and some of the smackinori stuff. And do you know what? I, the, the, the Katana videos, I, I've been thinking about them a lot. Um, they're the most fun. But yeah, let me know what you want to see, and hopefully we'll start getting some videos up a little more, more regularly, and hopefully I won't cripple myself again in the meantime and stuff. So, take care, and hopefully I'll see you soon. Bye.